racism all over the country, and segregation was illegal. And John was a part of that, and he knew it was wrong, and I knew it was wrong. We couldn't go to movies with anyone else. We couldn't do anything that other whites so that came back could do. And we began to say, enough is enough. My oldest brother had gone into the service and went to Germany uh, to fight there. Then he came home, and he was home for about six months, and he was killed in a racial incident in my town. Right, in the 60s, growing up here, total segregation. And it was in that environment of segregation that we began to dream, or at least John began to dream, and I started buying into that dream of how can we change this community from the inside out so that we can give people dignity, pride, self-worth, and self-esteem. John Perkins is a great man because he's lived out a big vision. He's focused his life around a purpose that's a big purpose and that all of that's driven by the gospel of Jesus Christ. This makes him a big man, and he has served that purpose faithfully, with focus, with passion, with intentionality, all of his life. He is not uh, just a talker. John Perkins is a doer. He's out there getting his hands dirty, working in these little communities and literally showing people how they can help themselves to a better life. See, I grew up without a mother. I grew up without a father. I grew up without an intact family. I grew up without the institution of love. That's what a family is, is an institution of love. A man finds out he loves a woman, and they fall in love, they get married, they have a child, they nurture that child, they've been loved, and I hadn't had that. I've never seen a picture of my mother. My mother died, really, of starvation, seven months after I was born, and we lived in a sharecropper shack, and they said she was nothing but skin and bone. I think part of my drive in life was really to be accepted, to be loved. And I heard that there was a God in heaven who had loved me so much that he sent his only begotten son into the world to die for me.